Hi, welcome back to Rebecca's Travels. So if you're watching my lifestyle channel, welcome back to Rebecca's Lifestyle. Hi, ho how are you all doing? I hope everybody is um, as well as possible. The weather in North Le uh, West Leicestershire has been sunny and, and cloudy. Um, and um, it's had um, also a lovely breeze as well at times. And uh, yes, it has been... Uh, quite warm at times today so um if you haven't subscribed to my channel please subscribe and i would love um uh, if you haven't subscribed for you to add to my squad and a big thank you for doing that and um, to, today i'm going to be doing travel news uk five exciting facts august 2023 Um, I'm going to dive right into the number one uh, fact uh, which is um, from business travel news europe.com um, the UK government um, has confir confirmed in 2024 an increase in rail fares uh, will be set uh, below the current rate of inflation uh, for the second consecutive year so it is going to be below inflation um, no, uh, moving on to number two the sun um, peak views the retro UK tourist town where Peaky Blinders was filmed, and you can live in the nineteen twenty, uh, live a nineteen twenties life. There is a museum inside um, a small market town in the West Midlands, um, where the hit TV show Pinky Blinders was filmed, and um, it's called the Black Country Museum. The Black Country Living Museum um, in Dudley allows visitors to see what life would have been like between the 1850s and the 1960s with a rapid high streets, retro houses, businesses, pu um, pub and um, even a chippy. Um, again, I've been to the Black Country Museum when I was um, a child and really recommend it. Um, so, um, if you do ever get chan a chance to go, then I would definitely go. Um, again, I've been to quite a few um, living at museums um, also the Beamish Museum twice and um, also um, one um, in Sussex um, uh, called Amberley and also the Transport Museum um, in Derbyshire that de are definitely all worth visiting um, I've been to all of those and I would Rec really recommend each of them um, especially if you want to see what it uh, life was like um, in uh, um, in history um, in in the old days uh, number three um, the Guardian uh, post pandemic fear of missing out at uh, sends UK gig prices soaring uh, to see famous celebrities so uh, unfortunately post pandemic if you want to go to a gig to see a celebrity then obviously prices are soaring and um, number four Rail UK um, track maintenance um, to affect journeys on the Kemble line uh, next week so I hope that gets uh, better um, 
from next week and uh, last but not least number five um tourists rush to visit an abandoned uk village that opens to the public once a year it's a 1940s it themed village world war ii curious visitors um, are permitted uh, to return on an annual imba bus um, this year's bus will return on the 19th of august uh, for one day so it's a one day bus and um, the bus service began in 2009 picking pa uh, passengers um, in Warminster up and last year there's, uh, there was around 2,000 people vi visited the village. The village um, is called Imba and it is in Wilkshire. So um, if you're around at Wilkshire and you get a chance to and uh, want to visit, uh, visit the village in Imba, um, as well as the uh, the bus service to the village, then um, again, um, you can do um, on the nineteenth of August. So I would like to say thank you for watching, and I'll see you tomorrow for another exciting video. And um, it's going to be um, the top ten most unusual hotels, um, August two thousand twenty three part two so um i'm really ex excited to present a part two to you so please keep watching and thank you and have a nice night or day wherever you are in the world thank you bye